Airbnb tour part two. I'm just a tally lap. Chloe tries on a hat. Day two, feeling a little under the weather. We're gonna try to get some coffee, potentially on a rooftop, and then uh, we'll play it by ear. We'll keep you in the loop because you'll you're coming for, along for the ride. Right outside of Keybok, heard about this place on the interwebs. Supposed to have some really good coffee, poke in, see what they've got. Thank God we got here when we did. So we just avoided the uh, Las Gringas Locas. Um, that's crazy white people for all of you out there. Artists at work in their natural habitat. It's like YouTube, but it's it's static. It's like oh, a video, but amazing. just one short paused video. I'm just a tally lad. Here's the coffee. So good. Very cinnamony. <laughs> but very sweet. Really good. They both got Hemingways. We're not sure what that is. Maybe a rip on a cappuccino and like cinnamon. I mean, with a name like that, it's probably good. Mm. Yes, this, my friends, is what a macchiato or cortado looks like. Please disregard yesterday's coffee in the video. God, everything's so much better. <laughs> they own a bakery and the bakery's next door and they actually have three locations. So their pastry is incredible. Their food is incredible. And their coffee is maybe not the best, but it's like strong. Like oh. I drank their portada and I was buzzed for like an hour and a half or two hours. I had to drink water. So, Cumpania, there's my plug. Hire me for something, I don't know. So we just left the cafe, very, very good. I highly recommend it. Found out a Hemingway is actually a coffee made with a Cubano and a Cubano is espresso packed with brown sugar and cinnamon and then they add two ounces of milk. So next time we come back, I'll definitely get a Cubano to try that out. We're now gonna head over to, I think the Ignacio Market. If you know what this angel looking sign is, please let me know in the comments. So we're at some park, there's a statue there. Haven't been here, we're near the market. Um, yeah, cool scene, completely kind of different from everywhere else we've been. All right, we are here in the market, let's go on inside. proper market there's stuff there's there's stuff there's things to buy there's produce there is lots of torta places there is like a shrimp cocktail place that I might check out but this is a big and proper market very very cool Chloe tries on a hat and young Chloe has acquired a hat
they're saying these magic beans turn into butterflies on March 21st, but there's a 99% chance I got that wrong. Looking to grab a torta and maybe some shrimp cocktails. All right, we just ordered some agua frescas and we got a torta and a oyster and octopus uh, cocktail. Lettuce makes it like kind of fresh. That's good. Way different than raw seafood, obviously. <laughs> Our light lunch quickly turned not so light. We are now heading down the street past the market where Chloe thinks she uh, lived when she lived here, I think in high school. For I'm feeling a little under the weather, so I'm bowing out early. The girls are still on the hunt for Chloe's old house. We'll pick up the footage with uh, Yoonjin Clark. Like, we didn't share anything, right? We are where I lived 20 years ago. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It. 
I kind of rusted, so heading to check out Chloe's crib. Then we're gonna hit a rooftop bar, I think. Let's go. All right, so this is uh, Chloe's Airbnb slash casita. Airbnb tour part two. Oh, really good lighting in here. Let's go find a rooftop bar. All right, 